Something that you may notice in a lot of your social networking places is that you can import your friends and so here's a quick shot from Twitter. You can import your contacts that you already have on your various social networks. So in order to do that you need to look at your contacts inside of either Gmail, Yahoo, or AOL in the case of Twitter and a few other sites have additional ones that you can look through. Notice that it can't look at your own Outlook database. It can't look at mail.app if you're on the Mac platform. So what you do is you gotta get all those contacts into this Gmail system. So to import your contacts, you see that it says import up here. You first want to jump into your Outlook system if that's what you're using. And you'll go to your contacts tab, go to file, then you'll go to import and export. Export a file and you'll select comma separated value windows. This is also known as a CSV file. And you'll see that you get to pick where you're exporting your contacts from. I'll hit next. Take note where you are saving your contacts. So you can browse and change where that gets saved if you would like to. You could say, I want this to be on my desktop for just a brief time, or you can put it on another location if you need to. So we'll stick it here on the desktop and hit, type in contacts in this location, hit OK then hit next then you'll hit finish so it's exporting our contacts and you'll go back to your Gmail you'll click import you'll browse through your desktop to find where those contacts file is and it will say .csv at the end of it and you'll hit open you could also filter them down and add people into a specific group if you'd like to. Then you'll click import. Once that gets imported, you'll then go and put in your contact information. So fill in your complete name in this location and then you'll hit find friends and you'll find a long list of people that are connected to your Gmail system. Another tip, if you are using anything like Aweber, GetResponse, Constant Contact, there are great ways to export your files from those platforms as well as a CSV file. That basically means it's like an Excel spreadsheet if you were to open it later. Uh, upload that information into that Gmail inbox as well and scan all of your social networks for that. It's a great way to quickly build your social network lists and find people that you already have connections with across many different social media platforms.